part of the Capricorn project is telling the story of Capricorn because it really had a major influence on our culture and American music. Um, Capricorn is credited by many with being the birthplace of Southern rock. And so we planned through the interpretive exhibits to tell that story set in Macon. And we'll also tell some of the uh, story of Macon's wider music history, but it'll mainly focus on Capricorn and what who recorded here and uh, what the impact of the music that was made here had on our, our culture. Uh, we chose Rick's Ward out of about eight proposals that were submitted. Uh, we had an interpretive plan that was written by Jared Wright, who's a local um, museum specialist and, and musician himself. Uh, he wrote the interpretive plan and the companies uh, made proposals uh, based off that interpretive plan. And it really was a very um, competitive process, but at the end of the day, we went with Riggs Ward. Um, we felt like they had a really good vision for how, what this would look like, and, uh, and, and uh, Jared had had previous experience working with them at the Atlanta History Center, so that was a factor in their favor. Uh, but we really think that they're going to do the best job of taking the interpretive plan and bringing it to life.